Hey kings and queens, this is Mel and Bob Studio, aka Amber, and I am preparing to go to the Northeast for the first time ever. Oh my god. I'm going with a group of friends. We're going to Pennsylvania, New Jersey, and New York. So look forward to those vlogs. Let's get into it. The next stop is Galleria Mall. This is quite literally my first time dress shopping ever. My friend's getting married in New Jersey and by the time we get there, it's gonna be cold as heck. And your girl loves her spaghetti strap, thin strap dresses. I love showing off my collarbones. Look at these cute dresses right here. But they're not gonna keep me warm. So the mission is to find a cute dress that will keep me warm. And so far, Dresses that keep me warm don't look cute, or just they're just not my style. Hello! I just finished my doctor's appointment and getting my blood drawn for the first time. You can't see it. But I'm a warrior. No, I'm not. Um, <laughs> my anxiety went up high and I was like breathing really uh, heavily. Like I was on a roller coaster or rock climbing for the first time. But the person who was drawing my blood, she's like around my age. She said I did well. She didn't know it was my first time either. The guy at the front desk that got my payment for the appointment was low-key cute. I was like, I didn't I didn't realize it until I was like face face to face with him. That sounded weird. <laughs> you know, facing him <laughs> to talk. <laughs> and I was like, okay, maybe I can see him again when I leave. He wasn't there. Anyways, I was excited to go to my doctor's appointment. Who gets excited to go to the doctor's? I have been waiting. I was excited because my habits have been going up. I've been a lot healthier. Like, I'm, I've been exercising, I've been eating healthier. But my health is kind of doing the opposite. <laughs> Obviously, my health is getting better in some ways because of my healthy habits, but in other ways, I haven't been to the doctors in like two years, so I guess it naturally just goes down. And now that I've had my blood drawn, I can see what's up. What's up? So my health is gonna go up from here. Up. Up in a good way. Okay. <laughs>
today I'm getting my updated COVID shot. This is gonna be the third needle in my arm this month. I don't I I don't like that. Okay. <laughs> but we've taken care of our health. Since I'm going to be traveling with a group of friends, we actually have a whole Google Doc shared together with information like our phone number, our hotel address, the closest hospital, the closest police station. Traveling is a big test of friendships, so what I always like to do is include travel rules. And these travel rules could have something like communication. Some of these rules may seem obvious, but... When you're traveling, you guys are going to be sleep deprived, stressed out, etc, etc. And you're going to get closer to your friends and see how differently they might act when traveling. And that might cause conflict in the friendship or it might cause you to be closer to your friends. In our travel Google Doc, we also included all the things we want to do. And for me personally, I have an entirely different Google Sheets because I have a long list of things I want to do and everyone gets overwhelmed looking at it. But in reality, it includes the top tourist place that everyone wants to go to. This long list of things I want to do is also a bucket list. So if I don't get to do everything, I can always come back to New York, Pennsylvania, and New Jersey.
at the clouds back there. It's crazy. <laughs> I haven't like walked this path since middle school, but we haven't run the mile. So a little bit nostalgic, not really, but kinda. Since I always overpack, I can never lift up my luggage to be able to put it in the overhead in the airplane. So this time, I'm testing it out and trying with my pure strength. I've gotten so much stronger over the summer, so 21 year old me would be scared of this version of me right now. But I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I could not lift this up still. But that's because I was afraid of hitting people, <laughs> so I just didn't want to do it. I think I just didn't want to do it, so it's not that I can't, it's just I was afraid to hit people. Thank you. 